A homeless point in time count is set to start next week in the Coachella Valley. The data gathered helps in the understanding of what resources and funding is needed in certain areas. News Channel 3's Miyoshi Price spoke with people experiencing homelessness right here in the valley. We have we haven't get a lot of harassment from the police right here. This homeless camp is off Crossley Road in Ramon in Cathedral City. Just one of the locations that Riverside County homeless point in time count will take place. Officials tell me they have a thousand volunteers to help count the homeless population in Riverside County. 500 of those are here in the Coachella Valley, helping them decide what resources are needed and where are being provided with information so that as they go out and if they come across any of these vulnerable groups, uh, they have a number that they can call and um, a direct linkage will be made. So someone will go out to meet that person and facilitate that linkage. Justin Silva is a father that wants to get off the streets. He has been homeless for five years. Like I work part time and, and some of them get a little bit of aid from the county and food stamps and stuff, but uh, we help each other. We help each other buy tents and stuff. This 23 year old man has been homeless since he was 16 years old. My comprehension ain't really that good, you know, like I can't really focus that well and sometimes I need help and some people don't help me, you know. Last year's count showed that Riverside and Palm Springs were the top two cities with the most unsheltered homeless population. These two found each other this year while experiencing homelessness. Just uh, try to get us into housing if possible, but make it maybe that where there's um rules that you have to abide by where you just don't go there and just mess the thing up. You have to be part of the community that you're in. And I think that would help a lot. In Palm Springs, Miyoshi Price, News Channel 3.